Hello there. Welcome back to the channel. Uh, you notice I don't have a mask on because, well, I cannot find my mask. So, here I am with the glasses. Here to give you a little uh, recap of what's happened in 2022, as well as what has happened in, around the Linux community, seeing as how 2022 has just ended. This, some people are saying that 2023 is going to be the year of the Linux desktop. Well, I kind of feel, personally, like 2022 was the year of the Linux desktop. Or perhaps it was the warm up 2023, 4 and 5 is going to be the battle. And one of those three will be the year when it all ends and Linux is the supreme overlord. But something tells me it won't at the same time. Honestly, I don't want to be a supreme overlord. I just want to see it get a good market share where, it's, where software is ported for it. But ultimately, market share has steadily increased. And we're at the point where, honestly, anyone can switch to Linux. Doesn't matter who you are, you can switch to Linux. So there's that. That whole argument I consider completely done. No more bullshit arguing about, but Linux is for everyone. No, if you haven't switched, you're probably not worth caring about at that point. So there's that. There's also more to this though. Um, at least to this year. You see, I've done uh, Sentinel Returns, I've done well, all sorts of different things. Well, you may notice I have something right there. That is a PC running Windows Millennium Edition. I actually installed Sentinel Returns on it and it worked perfect. It just doesn't boot anymore. So, it is packing. If we actually take a look here. A 60 gigabyte hard drive. I just showed my face. Fuck it. Who cares? An Intel Pentium 3 processor at 933 megahertz and 128 megabytes of RAM. I have pretty much just exposed my face, but. Ah, eh, fuck it. Who cares? At this point, I'm pretty sure they've already tied me to my actual identity that I exposed a long time ago on Facebook. So. Ah, eh, fuck it. What matters isn't my face or my name, it matters what I do. And as far as you're concerned, all I do is shill GLOO plus Linux. That's all that you feds need to know, okay? So, anyway, yes, I'm going to do many videos with stuff like that. There's also another one that I particularly like even more than that one. There is, of course, right here, my i3 system, packing 6 gigabytes of DDR3 memory and an Intel i3-530. There's also, from school, I managed to get, if I can pull it out, but I was working with the IT guy, and I managed to get, hold up, ground myself, I guess that worked. I don't know. A motherboard, which is socketed with LGA 1156. The i3 530 is an LGA 1156. And I also have another CPU somewhere. Don't know where it's at, but I'll find it. That one is an i5-520, uh, or 620, 650, I don't know. Honestly though, it doesn't matter. What matters is getting stuff and things done. Meow, meow, meow. I also do videos about the PS2 and whatnot. But there's one PC in here that I really happen to like. 
1 over less say hello to my little friend it's an old ass Dell XP machine so this is a Windows XP professional system with an this is embarrassing to say to be doing this whole video because I ain't got much information I'm just spewing bullshit but it has an Intel Pentium 4 and recall correctly it has uh, 256 megabytes of DDR2 RAM. Could you stop with the motherboard, kitty cat? And that's another thing. Seeing as I've had this little kitty cat for a while, I think it's time that I do the Lewis Rossman thing. Motherboard not for you, kitty. Look at that. Have the camera. And don't worry, his eyes aren't yellow with uh, toxins or anything. His eyes are just neon. Good buddy. But yeah. So, this year you're going to see a lot of things. A lot of things with a lot of different machines. And, you're biting my hand. He's biting my hand now. But you're gonna see a lot of things. So, with all that said, I think it's time. I think it's time I go ahead and finish this off and upload this. 2023. I've used Linux for an entire year for sure. This one. It's going to be a ride. I will see you all in the next one.